going on to your Aquarius out there so smash the like button um make sure to leave a comment in the comment section also too uh, there's a link in the comment section below called a link tree link click on it It will redirect you to a website which has all the ways to be able to financially support the show Let's get this video to 150 likes uh, Anyway, so for you Aquarius you have the seven of swords the knight of pentacles and then you have the nine of cups, right? So what it is that I'm seeing here for you um, Aquarius is that a lot of you are very much so stepping in, trying to get to know people, but you Aquarius are doing it the correct way. It's it's more, it's more, it, it, you, you Aquarius have a lot more game to you. You Aquarius have a lot more game. And what I mean by that is the seven of, the seven of swords and the knight of pentacles. You're, you are coming in respectfully, but at, at the same time, you Aquarius are not allowing other people to to get too out of hand with you. So in other words, the Knight of Pentacles, y'all are showing up, right? Ready to, to bring value to the table immediately if the person is serious. But what's what's behind that, or I should say part of what's behind that is self-respect. So you Pisces, excuse me, so you Aquarius, excuse me. You Aquarius are not going to allow someone to disrespect you, just haul off and start going too far. You will tell the person if they disrespect you to chill out. And if they keep doing it, you will leave them alone. And I see a lot of you Aquarius being a lot more direct with your communication. And telling people that, that if they don't know how to act, if they don't know how to come in with self-respect enough to not disrespect other people, then they're going to get gone. You're going to essentially dub them. They, they got to get left. Because the things that the Nine of Cups, the arrogance, the, the overconfidence and overvaluing, the delusion is too much. And a lot of you Aquarius, honestly speaking, I'm going to keep it a buck with y'all. I'm going to keep it a million percent with y'all. This is something that you Aquarius should have been doing for the longest time. And if you ask me, I think everybody needs a little bit of this. That 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 uh, everyone needs a little bit of that where it's like, listen, if you if you're serious, then let's then let's see where it is that we can go. You know, respectfully, if you're not serious, then you need to step off. And if the person is not serious, then it is what it is. Then they ultimately, you Aquarius can't take them seriously. Because oftentimes the disrespect gets a little bit too out of hand. It gets not even a little bit. It gets way, it, it, it gets so out of hand to the point where it's not even in the same, it's not even on the same planet. It's not even in the same solar system. It's not even in the same galaxy. All of this extra unnecessary disrespect that a good, especially a decent person, right, has to put up with, right, for a person who 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 has no self control, they completely can't like they com they look psychotic. They can't stop themselves from from you know what I mean. As soon as you Aquarius start interacting with them immediately, here they go with the stupidity. They they gotta they and they can't pull themselves back and and take a second to understand how goofy they made themselves look they they so caught up with the stupidity it's like they they doing stuff completely unprovoked you aquarius are trying to set up right a functional relationship or whatnot and they doing goofy stuff they clowning you they talking crazy to you they 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 can't stop with the jokes they being disrespectful they, you know what I mean? It's always, and it's like, what? And it's like, you Aquarius got to look at them like, what is wrong with you? You know? And now you Aquarius are not doing that. If a person has these type of problems, 
they've really got some serious issues. I've met so many people like that in my life. People who try to, who try to blame their dysfunction on me, oh, this, that, and the third. And it's like, listen, you, you just trying to hide the fact that you got real problems. You got some real psychological issues that you may need to really, but then again, too, seeking help ain't even really going to work because they don't ever actually come. See, this is what I'm talking about. You go to therapy to have a person help you come to a catharsis, come to a self-realization moment on what it is that you need to change about yourself and so that you can actually change. These people will even the therapy don't work anymore because these people who call themselves nowadays will go to therapy and they'll stay for therapy in the rest of their life. And it's like, no, you supposed to become the therapist to yourself when you go to therapy enough by understanding that it's the process. So now the five of cups now and the 10 of swords is about how a lot of you Aquarius, you know, it may, it may be a little bit discomforting at first, but ultimately the self-respect that you Aquarius have outweighs anything that someone can essentially act like, act like, or, or talk about how they're bringing to the table. So in other words, the self-respect that a lot of you Aquarius have, I see that for you, it outweighs or it's way more important than anything that a person will tell you that they can bring. So all of that, I'm making more money. I could do this. I could do that for you. I could it's like, listen, that's cool. I, I just see a lot of you Aquarius being like, that's cool, but you still don't care. Because at the end of the day, you Aquarius have real self-respect. And the Knight of Swords and the Queen of Swords represents you Aquarius are not going to allow someone who wants to be disrespectful and, and downright truculent. Look up the definition of truculent enter into your life and just disrespect you, you Aquarius will fight back essentially by leaving them alone. A word they you don't want to act like you got some kind of home training. You want to act like you got, you want to be crazy. Okay, I'll leave. Hey, delude yourself about your value some more. I'm going to be over here. And if you come over here without my permission, I will call the cops on you. So keep it up. The strength card now is about how um, the strength card now is about how um, uh, um, um, oh, sorry, the strength because I, I was just remembering how it is that sometimes people will very rarely they'll say it. But sometimes people will contact me rarely and be like, yo, you look like you don't play. Why are you trying to play is the question. Why are you trying to play? Like, whenever it is that people tell me stuff like that, I automatically see that as a as a real problem. Like, nah, I, I, I'm dubbed you. Because why? Because what you're trying to tell me is you scared of me or whatnot because I'm 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 doing what it is I'm supposed to be doing and that you 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 understand immediately that you have no room to be on some stupid stuff is what it is and you want me to back up off of the my life lessons so that you can have room to be a jackass is what it looks like and i'm not going for it and you don't like it that i'm not going for it that i will call the cops on you if you if you break my stuff I will call the cops on you if you do this. If you put your hands on me, if you get too crazy, if you come at me with a weapon, I will defend myself. I'm not playing games with you. I will do what it is that I need to do to survive. And 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 so, so Aquarius, so you got to understand this is where it is that we are now. This is where we are now. So now the strength card represents, so as a result, you Aquarius really are in a situation where that level of self-respect that a lot of you now have, keep that self-respect because that's your saving grace. The Ace of Wands and the Hermit, that's what makes it so that people can't disrespect you. 
But the Ace of Wands and the Hermit represents, and if you Aquarius need to take a break, take the break. Now, I don't necessarily see this being a, a reading based upon you meeting anybody per se. I'm seeing that this is this is something that you Aquarius are still putting yourselves out there trying to get to know people and what it is that you Aquarius are really finding out from your own experiences, your firsthand experiences, is that number one, and this is something that you Aquarius kind of, you, not kind of, you do already know profoundly, a lot of people out here are playing games. That's one of the things that you know. And another thing that I wanted to also go ahead and say is that not only people are out here playing games, which you already know, but also this is, you know, people want you to be okay with being, I can't even say that. I can't even say the A word, the A B word, but people want you to be okay with with being disrespected, and they want you to be okay with that. And you gotta, and it's not enough for them to do it. You gotta like it, and then help them do it to other people too. It's like nah, nah. And I see that a lot of you Aquarius have have way too much self respect and home training and downright decency to and, and you should you know to to call yourselves trying to get down with other people's agendas of doing that so let's clarify the hermit page of swords lovers five of wands two of swords nine of swords right because at the end of the day all of those people who has let me show you what I'm talking about. Page of Swords, Lovers, because at the end of the day, all of those people who disrespected you, guess what happened, right? The Five of Wands, the Two of Swords, that was so difficult for you to be in a relationship with, guess what happened? Nine of Swords. Those exes, the ones who disrespected you, treated you like trash, they're doing this. The Nine of Swords. They're laying down on their bed right now or if not laying down, then maybe they're at work. But wherever they are is the point that I'm trying to make. They're, they feel terrible at the fact that they had you, Aquarius, and they played so much. They went so far. They played so many games. They squandered their opportunity to be with you acting like an idiot. 